tutorials Wow for those of you who are new to my channel and randomly just stumbled upon this video my name is Yvette Santos and make sure to subscribe put your post notifications on bam, 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 bam. if you guys haven't checked out my previous Halloween tutorials then definitely definitely stop by and watch them as soon as you guys are done with this video I am having a huge enormous giveaway very soon extremely big so if you guys are interested in knowing how to enter or any of that then put your post notifications on so you guys can see when I post it and be aware because I'm posting the giveaway very soon also this entire month I will be uploading of course every Wednesday and every Sunday new Halloween tutorials so if that's your thing or if I'm your your thing or my channel is your thing YouTube is your thing that you should definitely 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 subscribe so today's Halloween tutorial is going to be on a demon I'm going to be creating a very scary demon so um, let me just stop talking let me go straight into the tutorial I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys in just a second I'm going to start off by priming my eyes and I'm using my Too Faced Eyeshadow Insurance and I'm just going to be placing this on my eyelids and with my finger I'm just going to be gently blending that in throughout my entire eyelids. Going in with eyeshadow, I'm using my absolute fave, which is the Huda Beauty Desert Dust Palette. And I'm going to be starting off by using the color Desert Sand and I'm just going to be setting my eyeshadow primer. Next color in the palette I'm using is the color Saffron and I'm just going to be applying this on my eyelid and on my brow bone absolutely everywhere. There's no trick to this. You just apply it all over your eyes. Next palette I'm using is the Lotus palette from Veramona and I'm using that color Holy Hawk which is a very black matte color and I'm just going to be applying this on my crease from one end to the other. I'm now going in with my Stila liquid eyeshadow in the color Molten Midnight and this is a very sparkly wet type of eyeshadow that then dries and looks like glitter I love it so this is kind of a black silver glitter and I'm just applying this on my eyelids I'm now starting on my face and I'm going to be using the Smashbox primer water and I'm just spraying this all over my face making sure my face is primed for paint I'm going to be using my makeup forever paint set and I'm using that red color and with my beauty blender I'm just going to be blending this all over my face I'm going to be blending this on my neck on my ears absolutely everywhere when you apply with the beauty blender you just get such a gorgeous finish I'm going to be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pomade in dark brown and I'm going to be filling my eyebrows the same way I would normally do with any makeup look Using my NYX Matte Liquid Liner, I am going to be creating a wing liner, very long, sharp, thick wing liner. For lashes, I'm going to be applying my Huda Beauty Lashes in Lana, my absolute fave, and I'm just going to be applying this on my lash line. I'm now going in with some black eyeshadow, and I'm just going to be smoking out the bottom of my eyes, my waterline, and then just applying mascara on my bottom lashes. Any mascara will do. Now I'm using a liner, like a eyeliner, a black eyeliner, and I'm just going to be creating, I guess you can say, the teeth of this demon, and I'm just creating different shapes everywhere. With the same still liquid eyeshadow I used previously, I'm just going to be filling in the empty spots of these shapes I've created, I guess you can say. And I'm just going to be filling it in, making them nice and sparkly. Now 
Going back in with my NYX Matte Liquid Liner, I'm just going to be tracing each of the shapes because it's just going to make them pop out so much more. With a very small, thin, detailed brush and some black eyeshadow, very, very lightly, I'm just creating some shadows in between the teeth, the shapes, whatever you guys want to call it, of this mouth. Okay guys, so I am completely done. This is the final makeup look of my Halloween tutorial of a demon. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, give it a thumbs up. If you guys found it helpful, don't forget to comment, subscribe. I love you guys. Don't forget to put your post notifications on because I do upload videos every Wednesday and Sunday. And for new upcoming Halloween tutorials, I am pretty sure... You guys want to see that. So, uh -huh. put your post notifications on so you guys can be aware every single time I post a video. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting. And I'll see you guys in my next YouTube tutorial. Bye, guys.